Happy Tuesday, Danbury. This is student meteorologist Jordan Chaplinski with the WestCon weather team forecast coming to you from the broadcast room in the science building at our Midtown campus. We did have some showers and some fog to start the month of November, but will that remain the case over the next few days? Find out in just a few minutes. Uh, we are going to first start off with a look at our Midtown campus right now, and we don't have any showers at this time. We do just have mostly cloudy skies out there right now. Temperature is 62 degrees. The dew point is up there as well, right around 58, and that's the reason why you may have encountered some patchy fog out there this morning. And the winds are out of the southwest at around 6 miles per hour, so that's obviously a warmer wind direction. On the weather headlines, in addition to the slight chance of showers uh, that we will have out there today, if you don't see showers, we will just see some mostly cloudy skies out there. And there may be, uh, however, there may be some brightening later on in the day. And that's going to remain the case through tomorrow and on Thursday as well. And it's going to be mild out there as well, temperatures into the 60s. And then clouds, uh, some clouds make a return to the area by the end of the week and into Saturday and so will some warmer temperatures as well. We may make a run at 70 degrees. I'll have that in the five day forecast coming up in just a few minutes. But as we take a look at our satellite and our uh, satellite loop, I should say right now, we do have a cold front over the Hudson Valley of New York, stretching down through New Jersey and through the Delmarva Peninsula as well. And it's attached to this area of low pressure that's basically centered right around the capital district of New York. That's the reason why we have uh, the clouds and out ahead of it, a wind out of the southwest, but as that cold front pushes through our area, that'll usher in some uh, sunny and actually milder conditions for where it should be for this time of year as we head through the next couple of days. We just have to get through today. On our uh, radar right now, over most of Connecticut, there's not really any organized areas of rain. There is a little bit down toward our south and uh, east and up toward the northwest as well, but we may see some of those sneaking in toward our areas we head through later today. The forecast for today, as I mentioned, calls for that slight chance of showers. Otherwise, it's going to be mostly cloudy winds out of the southwest at around 5 miles per hour, 67 degrees for the high today. So that's about 10 degrees above where we should be for this time of year. And for tonight, it's going to be warmer than average as well with mostly clear skies, maybe some patchy fog building in after midnight once again. Low temperature, 52 degrees, winds out of the northwest at around 5 to 10 miles per hour. And as we take a look at the five-day forecast, Again, 67 for today, brighter and a little bit warmer for tomorrow. So sunny and mild for tomorrow, 68. Slightly cooler on Thursday, but still sunny, 64. And then to end the week for Friday and Saturday, temperature on Friday, 67. Uh, it will be mostly sunny and milder out there as well. And then a slight increase in clouds and a slight increase in temperature for Saturday when we get to 71 degrees. And it'll be partly cloudy and uh, unseasonably mild for this time of year. Don't forget to check us out on all of our social media platforms. In the meantime, have a great rest of your day, everyone.